Uh, what time is it? Okay, it's only two in the morning. Not bad. My nights normally only get started at this time. Looks like she's still asleep. Of course, she's hogging the whole couch to herself, as usual. <laughs> Hey, taking up the whole sofa again. I'm literally on the edge of falling off. Are you still sleeping? Wave your hand if you're awake. Nope, she's out cold. Probably having a nice dream as well. I just can't seem to sleep right now. My insomnia is kicking in and it's killing me. I think I still have a sleeping pill lying around the house somewhere. But where did I put it? Oh, that's right. The bathroom cabinet. Ugh. But if I move, I'm gonna wake her up. Talk about a tough decision. Alright, screw it. She needs some rest right about now. The past week hasn't really been all that kind to her considering she just got a promotion at work. Meaning they have been overworking her to death. Against all odds though, she does seem to be having a lot of fun at work. I'm really happy for her. She's going to go far in life, I can tell. <laughs> Crazy to think that we've been friends for so long now. Well, it feels like it's been a long time. How many years has it been? Almost six years now. Damn, time moves fast. I remember seeing her for the very first time, thinking that she was way too cool for a person to be friends with someone with the likes of me. She's so extroverted, has a bubbly personality and a loved by everyone. She does have a cute smile too. I've told her this many times. Meanwhile, I am the complete opposite of that. But hey, I guess they weren't lying when they said that opposites attract. Now she's one of the only people in my social life that I can actually rely on. Damn, that was a really fun night though. Getting drunk, staying indoors and watching one of my favorite stop motion animation pictures ever made. Coraline. I love the movie to death. If I asked anyone else to spend the night with me watching my favorite movie, they would have instantly turned me down in a heartbeat. But nope, not her. She's a true gem. See, if her and I dated, and I mean this, I would try my absolute best to make her as happy as I can. I've crossed you for a while now. Oh, I think I said that too loud. I hope she didn't hear me. You hear me? <sighs> okay, no response. <sighs> I dodged a bullet just now. Holy crap. <laughs> but, I mean, it is the truth though. I'd bend my back just to make her as happy as she could possibly be. Being a friend for so long, I've seen just how many people have come and gone in her life. Not treating her the way she deserves. But, to be honest, I don't think I'll ever tell her my true feelings for her any time soon. I'm way too much of a coward to face rejection. And I mean, her being around like this tonight is more than I could ever ask for. Oh, it is what it is. 
I might as well just shut up before she wakes up and hears me cringy outspoken thoughts. <gasps> oh, so you're finally awake. I didn't bother you, did I? I honestly didn't mean to. What was that? You're asking me what I just said a couple of minutes ago. Oh, uh, nothing. I was just talking to myself. I wasn't able to sleep, so I just sat up and started rambling nonsense. Maybe it's the alcohol that's keeping me awake. <laughs> What? Heard everything I said. Oh, no, 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 no. I, uh, I think you were dreaming or something. <laughs> hey, could you say that again, please? I couldn't show you properly the first time. You have a crush on me as well. Wait, what about tonight? What are you talking about? No, I didn't make anything of our plans tonight. I just thought it was another Friday night where we got together and just watch each other's favorite movie. Oh. Oh. I think I get it now. <sighs> Why didn't I pick up on this before? It's not like you just hang out with anybody else every single weekend. On top of that, we don't even have the same friend groups. But we always hang around each other. God, I'm an idiot. I'm so sorry for not picking up on all of this sooner. I had suspicion, but I didn't act on them because I thought I was going to make things awkward. And I did not that to happen at all. Off chance you didn't share the same feelings. <sighs> this is great news to hear though. I'm ecstatic. If it wasn't so dark right now, you'd be able to see my dumb smile on my face. Tell you what, I'll spot you fall asleep on my chest tonight and we can have a nice conversation about the direction we're going to take this relationship in the morning. I'll even make pancakes. <laughs> Alright, I think you should be getting some rest right about now. You've been busy all week and now this is your time to relax as much as you can. Don't worry, I'm not going to go anywhere. I've actually gotten pretty tired myself right about now. It's like I don't need that sleeping pill in front of the bathroom anymore. Thank you for spending your time with me tonight, by the way. I just thought I'd let you know that I had fun. See you tomorrow, I guess. <laughs> Thanks so much for making it to the end of the video. Um, this is Salvo speaking to you guys directly now. Um, I don't always like to end the script or to end the video with unscripted events like this, but I just wanted to take this moment to say thank you for the support that you've been showing me uh, in the comments and the likes and the engagement with the channel. Um, and I only hope to make better content uh, in the coming weeks. <laughs>